Hey everyone, it's Matt here. Welcome back to another episode of Savant's Tech Talk. Cryptocurrency trading is well known for being a high risk investment. And it's unavoidable that markets are going to experience downturns. So for you as a trader, crypto hedging strategies might be the best way for you to safeguard your money from danger. Hedging entails taking positions in opposite market directions to mitigate the risks that you might experience due to the market's volatility. So you might be asking yourself, what exactly is a hedging strategy? What are the dangers of cryptocurrency? How might hedging strategies be applied to the crypto market? Is there a risk-free way to hedge? Well, in today's video, we're gonna answer everything that you need to know about hedging strategies. As always, if you find this topic interesting, then you can let us know by hitting that like button and subscribing to this channel for more videos. You can also let us know if you find it interesting by leaving a comment saying so in the comment section down below. Now let's jump into it. So what is hedging? Hedging is a risk management approach used by traders to mitigate investment loss. Hedging strategies allow traders to place many simultaneous bets in opposite directions in order to reduce the chance of significant losses. For a long time, hedging has been a financial market strategy for crypto traders as a risk management approach. In unfavorable market conditions, it allows you to keep the value of your investments consistent but without making a significant profit. Hedging crypto protects your funds from market fluctuations, but it also restricts the possible gains from your cryptocurrency investments. But this is a preferable option for risk adverse crypto traders, as opposed to losing all of their funds due to market volatility. Now let's have a look at the types of risks involved with cryptocurrency. Volatility, regulatory, transactional, and leverage risks are present in the cryptocurrency market, just like they are with the Forex market. The volatile nature of cryptocurrencies poses a significant risk. Speculative trading is the most common type of trading employed in trading cryptocurrency. And as a result, it's critical to comprehend the risks. Volatility. Since cryptocurrencies are volatile, abrupt and unexpected price changes are expected as market sentiment shifts. The value of cryptocurrencies may fluctuate dramatically by hundreds or even thousands of dollars at a time. Unregulated. Cryptocurrencies are not regulated by governments or central banks. While governments and financial organizations are beginning to notice, Questions remain over whether they should be classified as commodities or virtual currency. Because there are few rules to safeguard sellers and purchasers, investors must rely on developments, people, and personal experience to make investment judgments. Transactional risks. Crypto traders can suffer significant losses due to communication errors and delays in executing their orders. So selecting an exchange that can manage a high amount of transactions per second is critical. Leverage. Traders can benefit from a high degree of leverage by using modest margin deposits and collateral. Traders should avoid employing excessive leverage since it might raise losses in an unfavorable market. So now that we've looked at the types of risks involved with cryptocurrency, now let's look at the hedging strategies. Short selling. Short selling assets is a great method of hedging cryptocurrencies for traders. Short selling is the practice of selling an asset when it's expected to fall in value shortly and then repurchasing it at a lower price. Short selling is initiated by traders examining a cryptocurrency's price chart. So for example, you might use divergence analysis to spot indicators of a possible trend reversal. Traders can borrow a certain amount of crypto from an exchange or a broker and sell the borrowed tokens on the market once they notice indicators of a negative trend. They can repurchase the same quantity of tokens at a lower price and return them to the exchange or broker if the crypto's price declines. If the price rises, then traders will have to purchase back the same number of tokens at a higher price, resulting in a loss of money. Futures trading. A futures contract is an agreement to sell or purchase an asset at a specified price on a specific future date. The futures can be traded before the agreed upon date because it has a secondary market. Investors and business owners will have more liquidity as a result of this. Futures contracts are a derivative trading instrument that includes contracts for difference, options, and swaps, among others. Futures contracts for cryptocurrencies work very similarly. Because cryptocurrencies are so volatile, most traders purchase when the prices are low and sell when the prices are high. On the other hand, such selling and buying might cause investors to miss out on a potential profit. Cryptocurrency futures enable you to keep your position open, allowing you to maximize the gains from your cryptocurrency investments. Diversification of portfolio. 
The most straightforward approach for traders to avoid losses in the crypto market is to have a diverse portfolio. Diversification refers to buying a variety of crypto assets rather than putting all of your money into just one. Each coin in a diversified portfolio works as a hedge against another. As a result, if the price of one token drops, the overall loss is less than if a trader put all of their money into one cryptocurrency. A diversified approach, in general and preferably, entails investing in assets that don't move uniformly, since as a trader, the best case is to invest in a variety of independent and non-correlated assets. The cryptocurrency market, on the other hand, is distinct from the typical stock market, which includes a wide range of asset classes and sectors. Cryptocurrency assets have a lot in common and trend in the same direction. So as a result, achieving a properly diversified crypto-only portfolio may be challenging. So now let's have a look at some essential steps to consider before hedging in crypto. Before using hedging techniques, undertake research and learn how to utilize, interpret, and evaluate price charts. Also, learn how to trade on cryptocurrency exchange as a trader. Once you have a basic understanding of how to trade cryptocurrencies, use a simulated trading platform to practice your hedging strategy. After getting the hang of it, begin hedging actual cryptocurrencies in modest quantities and gradually increasing the size of your holdings. Hedging is a standard method used by traders in the traditional stock market and the cryptocurrency market to reduce risk. In today's extremely unpredictable investment environment, it's a valuable tool for maintaining crypto holdings and protecting your profits. When utilizing hedging methods, traders should be aware of transaction costs and the dangers of using leverage, both of which can reduce yields. And lastly, hedging is a risk management method that traders should bear in mind. It doesn't always mitigate risk. In fact, it can often be counterproductive, limiting the amount of profit that could have been gained. So there we have it. We've looked at what hedging is, the types of risks involved with crypto, and hedging strategies. Once again, if you found this video interesting or helpful, then don't forget to let us know by hitting that like button and subscribing to this channel for more videos. Thank you for watching.